take it. No, that's <laughs> fine. <laughs> I was panicking. So, the reason that we would do a shallow run of landing, uh, one case would be a rough running engine. Let's say that uh, our engine sounds like it's going to die and it's not performing very well. We don't want to pull very much power. We want to keep our manifold pressure as low as we can. So we're keeping a shallow approach, kind of putting us in a, a prime, like, uh, auto-rotating uh, uh, state. So you're clear left. Good, and I'm going to kind of take over just a bit. Okay. So this is looking pretty good for our normal. We're at about 800, and we'll kind of hang out here, maybe bring it down to 700 before we get down to our obstacles. A little bit of left pedal. There we go. There we go. And we'll keep this. And we're going to clear left. So, we're coming in nice and low. That spot's about four inches above the light of dot, and I'm not sure. But point being, we're coming in nice and slow. So, what we're trying to do... do it that well, but what the goal is to come in nice and slow, and uh, as, by the time that you get out of ETL, that's the point that you should be touching down. And what happened with me, I got out of ETL a little bit high, so we had to pull, we had to use more power, and that's why the nose started coming around on me, yeah. and I didn't have that pedal input, so I should have been touching down a little bit faster in ETL to get it on the ground before that, that ETL's gone. Yeah, because we don't want to put anything sideways. Right. And yeah. Okay. Cool. I had no idea you could do that. Yeah. We're calling a clear set second, that call sign. All right, and you can pick it up. So yeah, another reason you might do it is if we don't have enough engine power to like take off. One hundred. Expect four thousand one two. I'm going to attempt for departure. Departure frequency one two three point seven. So let's say four seven to four seven. Let's say that we're in a high density altitude situation, so like maybe in Colorado on a hot day. And, all right, let's set it down. Let's say that we don't have enough power to take off, like in a hover, like traditionally. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try and figure out what our power setting is. So we're picking it up until we get light on the skids. And follow with me, this is gonna get kind of weird. Yep. <laughs> Light touch. So we're still on the ground. Pulling about 74 inches. Or sorry, 74%. We're just skidding along until we can get. I'm pulling too much power, but that's ETL right there. Okay. Never really worked in this one. Yeah, I don't want to wear the skids down too much, but you can take off like that, like take off like an airplane, pretty yeah. much. 
so that you're able to take off with with that limited amount of power. That's absurd. Yeah. All right, all ready? Yeah. All right, you got controls. I have controls. Point three seven two zero Bravo November direct maintain two thousand one hundred expect seven thousand one zero minutes after departure departure frequency one two three point seven clock one There's one one two L. good push four three eight a little bit of left pedal very good and then there's that forty five and then just let it climb awesome really good take off back right keep the nose straight that's the only complaint but okay. Yeah, that's insane that you can make a helicopter take off when it doesn't have enough yeah. power to take off. Like I said, still learning this aircraft, so not, it's not great, great, but... 1837, right. You do really well on 22. Yeah, you're clear, clear left. Clear left. It just seems like, well, if you don't have enough power, just, you know, hang out. Go have yeah, a but there's some places in the world that you can. You know, we're pretty fortunate because we're 400 feet off the sea level. Yeah. You know, we normally always have the power. Um, we always have the power. Clear left. Even on hot, humid days, we still have enough power. Yeah. Now, if it's that same hot, humid day in some place like Colorado, they're probably not going to have enough power to take off. So they have to take off with that little running start. Yeah. My dad was talking to Jim about these. They're, they would... Good, so you're letting it drop just a bit too much. Yeah, whoa. There we go. Yeah. Good. Good. In that turn, you dropped the collective, so that's why we get that big drop like that. Yeah. But now we're at 80 knots. Uh, sorry, 800 feet. Slow us down to 60 knots. Good. Take out a little bit of power as you do that, otherwise we're going to start climbing. Good. And you're clear left. Clear left. That turn a little better this time. Oh, that's a sharp turn. A little bonanza there. Uh, a Baron, which is uh, just it, basically it's a uh, two-engine uh, Baron. The engine baron. Seems a little shallow here, but. Uh, no, it's looking alright. Yeah. Maybe a little bit shallow. Yeah, yeah, maybe a little bit shallow. Ready at uh, 1 2 right. 162 contact St. Louis departure. Good. That's looking contact good. Contact St. Louis departure 162. Good. So we're slowing down and descending. Add a little bit of collective. Good. Let it sink. And add a little bit more, a little bit of red pedal. Good. Feel how that nose came way high? Yeah. Good. So you can descend like at a level attitude and then just kind of use the collective. One to right click to go flying in your Do you slow your descent rate down rather than doing like a big flare like that? Oh, okay. So let's go around. Let's try it again. I'll see if I can show you what. that left pedal. There's ATL. Very good. Keep that nose straight. There's your 45 and then let it climb. 387 now, 511 heading. I'm sorry, sir, I didn't copy. 387, 511 heading. Runway heading for 387. A little slow. Yeah, so we'll keep it 
at about 50 whenever we get about here, so whenever uh, we should have been at about 50, so that looks perfect now.
Very good. And let it back out as you level off. Yeah. Good. Actually, we're at 800 now, so you can keep whatever you have. So. Ten and ten, nine hotel, hotel on a left page for one two left. Nine hotel, hotel one two left. Where are we? One two left. Here's the option on our hotel, hotel. Eventually, you'll learn all the personalities in the tower. Yeah. It's kind of fun. Clear left. Clear left. Now that we have working audio, i got to be careful what I say, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, no, they're all really good people, though. It's cool. But they all they all definitely have their own personality. Start on fair 55, Romeo Hotel, with you at 1700. Awesome. Yeah, this looks good. Uh, Fire Romeo Hotel, yeah, down, down, down. Yes, sir, we're with you. Uh, it's slowed down. It's about to your location. We are doing a river over flight. Uh, next to the downtown, we'd like to pass your space if that's okay. Fire Romeo Hotel. Yeah, that's all right. Fire Romeo Hotel, Roger. Roger. Thank you, Fire Romeo Hotel. Good, it's a slow down more. As you add collective, you normally have to push forward and move your attitude is very forward to begin with. So good, add some collective, forward, right pedal, let it descend. Good, good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Besides that, we're all pretty good. Happened there. Uh, just a lot of torque in the, the, the bottom. Okay. We had it under control though. We went full 360, but yeah, but. <laughs> I think I was waiting for your help and then there was no help. <laughs> it was all controlled, I mean, yeah. Holy sh**. Thank <laughs> jeez. That was a bad approach from the beginning. It just got away from me. Really? Yeah, it felt like it was way high. Yeah, it was maybe a little bit high, but you coming in, you're kind of figuring out what to do. At the bottom, we pulled a lot of power. So whenever you pull a lot of power, you're going to need to put in a lot of right pedal yeah. to compensate for that torque. So you pulled in that power without putting in that torque, and then that's where we started that slow left turn. And it was pretty controlled, so I decided to let you go with it. So <laughs> it felt ridiculously uncontrolled. <laughs> All right, so we can take off whenever you're ready. Lights are out, gauges in the green, and we got plenty of fuel. So tiptoe forward. Wait for that ETL. Where are you this time? Where are you? Find you. You bastard. What? Whoa. That sideward, uh, that little sideward, uh, no takeoff. Yeah, it got me on that one. There we go. Very good. Now we're at that 50 knots. That's just, you're right. When you think about it, it starts to happen now. <laughs> Felt high on power on that one, but. Yeah, you got a good way of articulating what you need to do. That's the most important thing. I tried to teach a few girls how to climb and snowboard. Huh? And unless you have the words, it doesn't work. And yeah. You a good way of relating it. So that's... You should have seen me whenever I first started. Clear left. Clear left. I was way worse. <laughs> you, just, you just do this. <laughs> yeah. Just it's so hard to kind of figure out what's going on exactly, you know? Yeah. And you clear left. Clear left. Yeah, it's hard to figure out what's uh, what exactly is going on. Yeah, and then figuring out how to relate that to someone in words that yeah. they can understand. So there's a company camera? The yeah, camera back there? Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, very nice piece of glass on it. I like it. <laughs> that we have no business owning, but we needed it for a project. Is it a 200? Yeah, 7200. Yeah, it went a long way, went to right. Doesn't have the uh, stabilizer, but it's close. Report right, down went 1 to right, 827. Is it 827 or 872? 827. 80. So I'm going to drop a little bit. Yes. Pass our mark. Yeah, Town Tower, Coast Guard, Oxair, 55 Romeo Hotel. Coast Guard. Fire Romeo Hotel downtown. Yeah, it looks clear. If you're for okay, we'd like to transition back to St. Louis Approach. Fire Romeo Hotel. Fire Romeo Hotel, uh, quick exchange for Fire Romeo Hotel, thank you. Are you clear left? Clear left. And a little bit of power. Very good. Down to Hotel Hotel, one to left corner. One to left, good. Yeah, I know Hotel Hotel. 
Very good. All right, so add just a little bit of power, and that'll get rid of this descent rate, and that'll keep our 60. Very good. I feel like you're getting the hang of it, though. It's coming. It's just slow. So, 
He'll say option one two, or he'll say Niner Hotel Hotel option one two right. Uh, one two left, two left, clear for the option, clear for the option. Niner hotel, hotel one two left, clear option. He'll say one two left, clear for the option. Niner Hotel Hotel. One two left, clear for the option. Ho uh, helicopter nine Hotel Hotel. Perfect. <laughs> nice. That was good. All right, let's take out a little bit of power. We'll get our descent in. See the birds? No. Boosted. Downtown tower. Just a nine five five two. Yeah, they were over us. You just see their white belly, and whenever they whenever they turn to like bank, then you can see it. It's like ah. <laughs> good. So add a little bit of power. We'll we're, we'll get down to our. Uh, Target altitude here. Okay. So we're a little slow. So that's the only reason I say that. Yep. Uh, and you're clear left. Clear left. Good. This looks good. We're at our 800. At about 60. You making radio calls and whatnot. Yeah, they feel rough. <laughs> it's just, you know, muscle okay, memory. Okay, people mess up. I, I one time said every single helicopter in the fleet. Um, we left as a, a flight. Near clear left. Um, uh, two minutes, one to right, clear for takeoff. We left as a flight, right, so meaning two off. helicopters, like, flying together, like, in a, a you know, uh, uh, like a, a formation, I guess. We're just kind of following each other. But anyways, we left as a flight. Whenever we came back, I forgot where we were flying. And so it's like, uh, yeah, I'd like to land at the Foster Ramp. Uh, Niner Echo Hotel, uh, 32356. I'm like, that's 08 X-ray. You know, it's like, yeah. Went through everything. That's like when you're calling your kids, man, I am high on this one. Good, so let's go two dash marks, uh, one dash mark past the spot. One dash mark past the spot, all right. Uh, this looks pretty good. Maybe a tad high, but yeah, I'm trying to dump as much as I can you know, safely. Good, so it starts slowing us down. Alright, pedals preempted this time. Power. Keep the nose on the right. Keep the nose on the right. There you go. Add some power. Oh. The attitude straight. Not too bad, other than the attitude. Pretty good. I got a plan for way more pedal. Okay. Alright, you can get on the go. We got a guy waiting for us. Okay. So. Lights are out, gauges in the green, plenty of fuel. There's ATL. Good down. Pages are one to right. Clear down. Look at you, flying like a madman. You're good. Right. Right. Clear for the option 827. Looking 21 to left, clear for the echo. Yeah, it feels a lot better. What is this, hour uh, six? No, uh, five and a half, I guess so, yeah. yeah. Four and a half, I think it's four and a half. Feels good. Better. Left. Left. I haven't checked that windsock for a while. Is it doing it? Is it windy today? No, it's not very windy. No. You can also look at the water to see if there's any ripples. Uh, the 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 airborne. And you're clear left. Uh, say again. Roger, just walk me for Everybody messes up. 
It's uh, hard in this one because there's no tail number written right here. Yeah. Um, we'll get that. Just a bit. It's kind of a difficult approach. 
Yeah, I'll just follow along now. So you have control. I got control. Those power lines scare the shit out of me. As they should. Disengage light off. Yes, so disengage clutch. So we wait uh, 10 seconds after that light goes off. Are we doing on time? Oh, perfect. Yeah, we got 20 minutes before class. Perfect, perfect. Okay. Once that goes out, <sighs> I hit mixture. Yep. And then you'll wait for the beep, and you'll get the ignitions. Come down here, get these two. Come up here, get the rotor brake. Get it stopped and then do. Yeah. Okay. And Alright, so lights out, so just wait a little one. bit as these are uh, separating. Seven, That's probably eight, good. Nine. Okay, so there we go. Oop, ignition. Hold it, hold. Wait for the uh, beep. Now you can. Good. Okay. These good. two? Yep. And now break. wait for the. Uh, rotor bra rotor to get under the triangle, triangle carrot thing. All right, all good. So in comes brake. 